Thomas Boston's Personal Covenant, produced by Modern Puritans. To browse other updated works, visit modernpuritans.com. O Lord God, the Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, I'm admitting from the bottom of my heart that I'm naturally a lost and messed up sinner. I'm completely flawed and cursed because of Adam's breaking of the original covenant. I've only made things worse for myself with countless wrongdoings, making my life seem like nothing but vanity, sin, and foolishness. I'm totally aware, and I wholeheartedly admit, that I can't save myself from this pit of sin and misery I'm in, not even a little bit. It's beyond anyone or anything in this world to pull me out of it. So, I'm doomed forever unless you, with your powerful hand, decide to help me out. Since there's a pact of grace between you and your Son, Jesus Christ, for the salvation of lost sinners, where He fulfilled all righteousness by being born perfectly holy, living righteously, and satisfying justice through His death and suffering, you've promised to be their God and they'll be your people, making them holy and happy forever. This pact is offered to me through Christ in your gospel, and you invite me to join in this fellowship. So, sticking to my previous acceptances and commitments, without any intentional misunderstanding or deceit, I, a sinner who deserves to perish, am once again embracing this pact for my own life and salvation. I believe in the name of Christ crucified, who, as the great high priest, offered himself as a sacrifice, paid the ransom, and brought in everlasting righteousness for sinners like me. I believe in the gracious words he has given me, and I trust him completely. I have faith that his righteousness will become mine, and through him God will accept me as his own. I will become a part of his people, and this will lead me to a life of holiness and happiness. Oh my God! With all my heart and soul, I accept this covenant as my only salvation and my deepest desire, all thanks to your grace. Jesus, in human form, is my only priest, my guarantor, my mediator, and my savior. Through him, God becomes my father, the Holy Spirit becomes my sanctifier, and God in Christ becomes my God. I completely surrender myself both physically and spiritually to Him, trusting solely in His sacrifice for my salvation. I let go of any belief in my own righteousness, actions, and sufferings. With every fiber of my being, He is my leader and partner, and I am His, entirely and forever, living by His guidance for Him and through Him. I accept Him as my sole prophet, oracle, and guide. I fully commit myself to Him to be taught, guided, and directed in all aspects of life by His Word and Spirit. I reject my own wisdom and the wisdom of this world. He is, with my wholehearted agreement, my only King and Lord. I completely surrender myself, both in body and spirit, to Him. I trust in His powerful hand to save me from sin, death, the devil, and the evils of this world. I commit to serving Him forever, guided by His commands and His divine plan for my life. I'm fully ready, Lord, you know this, to let go of and renounce every known sin, desire, or idol, especially the sin that tempts me the most. I also renounce my own foolish desires and any other powers besides Him, without any reservations or objections to His plan for me. I declare in your presence, Lord, that I am willing, through your grace, to uncover and let go of any unknown sins within me. I don't accept the doubts and reluctance in my heart that come with accepting your covenant. Despite these feelings, I trust that you will accept me, through your beloved Son, my Savior, who cleanses these and all my other sins with his precious blood. God, I hope this moment is recorded in heaven. Let my bed, the wood, the stones, and everything else in my room bear witness. Despite my unworthiness, on this second day of December 1729, I've embraced your covenant of grace as presented in your gospel for now and forever. In the spirit of this covenant, you are my God, and I am one of your people, from this moment onwards and for eternity.